I'll show you how to improve your table, adding a button to it. Let's get started. First of all, let's add format to this table. We will go home tab, then group styles, choose format table, and let's choose any format. Let's say this one. But when we click it, we will keep the My Table Head headers and click on OK. And we see that the color of headers is not changed. Why? Because we had any format here before, right? So let's go back, Ctrl Z, and then click again Home tab, Styles Group, Format Table, right click on our format and choose Apply and Clear Formatting and then click on OK. And now we have it. And now to add buttons, what we need is to click inside of the table. And when we click inside of the table, here appears the tab table design. When we click outside, it is not here, right? So we click inside, go to table design tab and tools group and click on insert slicer. And here we have a, a slicer or a button, what we need. I will choose region and click OK. And here we have our regions. Let's click inside of the slicer, go to slicer tab, and then choose columns. And let's say it will be three columns. And now we can put it here. And let's change the style. We will go to slicer tab again, choose slicer styles. And let's say it will be this one. And now we will go again into the slicer, right click go slicer setting and here and here we can click on display header click off and then okay and we will have our buttons and when we click in one of it it will be filtered by epic or by email or by latin and to click everything we need or to choose two, we can keep control and click on the second one. And again, keep control and click on another one. And if we will keep the first format, we will click on display header. OK. And in this case, we can remove the filter or we can click by multi-select and select two buttons. And that's all. Thank you for watching.